Hey, what's up, you guys? Welcome to my first Roblox tutorial. So, in this video, I'll te be teaching you guys how to make a variable. So, what is a variable? A variable basically means a value of an item or something, an object. So, first, just go to the workspace, click on p the plus button, but then click on script. Delete the print hello world. So first, let's just make a variable. I'm gonna name my my variable uh, ham. And also, you have to start your your variable with local and then space. Local ham equals that much. And you can do loads of stuff with it. You can print it. You can make a part do stuff with it. Yeah. So I'm a printer. Print ham. And also, if you don't have the output open, go on view and then output. Now, let's test the game. And then the value of the hamburgers is 111111. So it'll just say 111111. It'll print it in the output. Okay, so here's another example local local fish equals a hundred print fish now let's test the game and then we'll print a hundred but if you want to make it fish equals a hundred you can make it uh so yeah that's basically how you do the variables so I'm going to teach you guys another way to use a variable, how to use it to make a part do stuff. So let me add a part real quick. Let me move it up a bit. Make the trend, make the, the variable by saying local and I'm going to make part material equals quotation marks, I'll make it neon. And then I'll add another variable called local part transparency equals uh, 0.5 local encode off equals false. So we'll unanchor the item, so we'll fall down. Okay, now let's get on the actual stuff to make make the part do do the what the variables are so if you just play the game automatically it won't do anything look see it's still up there and it's not anchored wait now it's anchored okay so game dot workspace dot part or whatever you name the part dot uh material it's game dot workspace dot part because the workspace is the parent of the part and if you put it in any of these you can't see the part here's an example so if you want to put it in lightning it's not there anymore dot material dot equals uh part material so we make it neon Let's just put wait five seconds. Game dot works workspace dot part dot transparency equals part transparency. So make the part zero point five transparent, half transparent. Wait zero point five. Wait five seconds. And then game dot workspace dot part dot anchored equals anchored off so it'll put the anchor to false. Now let's test the game if the script works. Okay, so it's neon. Then it'll go half transparent. And 
then it would just fall down because it got unanchored. The seat's half transparent, as you guys can see. Here, guys, I've basically had to make a variable. All you have to do is make um, whatever you want your variable to be, and then yeah, you can make value or just make part do stuff with the variables like this. Being the workspace dot part dot material equals part material, which make it neon. So yeah, guys, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to click like and subscribe, if you guys are new. And yeah, I'll see you next time. Bye.